Hello guys, welcome to the HODL EOS channel. My name is Rob. In this video, we are going to walk through the Vigor protocol application, which can be found at app.vigor.ai. Starting off on the app.vigor.ai homepage, the first thing you need to do to use the application is log in with your EOS account. The login button can be found in the upper right hand corner. And when you click on that, you get your options scatter or anchor. Currently, my scatter is not up and running. I have my anchor up and running, so scatter is grayed out. And I will choose the anchor button. The Vigor app can also be accessed from many EOS mobile wallets directly from within the wallet. Again, I'm using Anchor, so I'm going to click the Anchor login button, open Anchor app, and the Anchor signing request pops up and allows me to select which account I want to use. I want to use account for demo account, so I'm going to go ahead and click the sign button and log in. Once logged in, you will see your account name that you have connected with, as well as your wallet balances. Here is a list of tokens I have in my wallet and not on the application itself. There is a warning icon next to my account name, and if I click that, I can see I have not signed the constitution yet. So click signed constitution, and the constitution will pop up. Read through it. Click I have read and agree to the terms of the Constitution and click Sign Constitution. Your wallet signing request will pop up. DAC token 1111, member registration, member reg, and agreeing to the terms of the Constitution for the account I have connected, account for demo, sign that request. I have now signed the Constitution, so I'm going to come up here and give this a refresh. That warning icon went to the check mark. I am now ready to use the Vigor app. Starting from the home page, there are three paths you can take. The View Dashboard button will take you directly to the dashboard. This is a single page with everything you can do on the Vigor protocol application, from lending your tokens to savings. Vigor loans and crypto loans, as well as the recent activity of users, as well as your account when you perform actions, and a recent bailout record. The other options on the homepage are step by step walkthroughs that will walk you through the process. If you'd like to receive rewards, this is the box to choose. If you'd like to borrow either Vigor or crypto, this is the path you take for the step-by-step -step walkthrough. Get rewards. For rewards, I can either become a lender or put Vigor into savings. If I want to become a lender, lend out my tokens and insure loans, click insure loans. And here you can deposit into insurance and get rewards. Select the token you want to deposit, put one EOS into here. Since this is my first transaction with the smart contract, there are two opening actions that need to be performed, Vigor Lending Open Account and Vigor Token 1-1 Open. And after that, transfer of my one EOS to the Vigor Lending Insurance and Lending Pool. I now see my one EOS has appeared down here in the Insurance and Lending Pool. And to get to the dashboard, in the upper right hand corner, the triple lines, is all the pages within the app, your dashboard, a Vigor Health page, links to all the walkthroughs. We are currently in the Insure walkthrough that we just completed. That's why it is highlighted in a different color. Borrowing, Vigor, and Crypto. Alerts you can set up to get Telegram alerts. The stats page and your resources on your account. So if we go to the dashboard, I can now see that one EOS I deposited into the Lend Pool. The tutorials on the homepage, Get Rewards, Become a Lender, which we just did, also Savings, and Borrowing. 
the borrowing of low volatility token Vigor or a crypto loan can also be found on the dashboard. For each section, there is a wizard button that will take you to that section. The wizard here will take us directly to the wizard we just completed from the home page. And for savings, same thing. As well as both Vigor loans and crypto loans, the wizard will walk you through step by step. First, needing to deposit collateral, deposit VIG to cover your premiums, and withdraw the Vigor loan. Collateral, I want to deposit 20 EOS into collateral. Click deposit. Signing request pops up, transferring 20 EOS to Vigor lending collateral. Sign that. In step two, we need to deposit some VIG tokens to cover the premiums on the loan. So I'm going to deposit 100 VIG tokens. Deposit. Hundred VIG tokens to the Vigor lending contract into the VIG fees. And finally, I can take out my Vigor loan in step three. What you type in here, you will see an estimated borrow rate, the estimated amount you will pay for one month for that loan and the collateral ratio based on the amount of collateral you put in. If I go up to 20 Vigor, you can see estimated borrow rate 2%, which would cost me 3.6084 Vig estimated for one month at a collateral ratio of 277%. So let's borrow that. 20 Vigor borrow going to my account. And now if we go back to the dashboard, here is the 100 Vig I put into Vig fees. Now you can see there is 0 0.0014 extra Vig in there. That is the rewards from the EOS I already deposited into the lending pool. That EOS is currently at a 4.3% and I am already seeing some rewards from that. You can see VIG rewards 0 0.0014. And if we scroll down to the loan section, we can see everything we just did in the walkthrough. I deposited 20 EOS into collateral and you can also see there is 0 0.0001 more EOS here than what I deposited. That is because the EOS is also receiving Rex and proxy rewards, and I already received some of those. And then over here, the 20 Vigor I have borrowed. So now in my wallet, I have that 20 Vigor. And we can see that on an Explorer, I have my 20 Vigor loan, Vigor lending sent to my account, the 20 Vigor for the loan I just took out. One thing I can do with these Vigor is pop them into the savings. Only Vigor tokens can be deposited into the savings to earn the savings rate. So if I wanted to put all those Vigor tokens I just took out into savings, max the 20 Vigor I just took out, I want to deposit those into the savings. Transferring 20 Vigor to the Vigor lending contract into savings. And now my Vigor are in savings and they will appear down here. And there they are. One thing you may notice at the top of Vigor loans and crypto loans is a reputation percentage and discount percentage. All users are ranked against each other based on how much Vig rewards they receive and how much Vig fees they pay. So the more you receive plus the more you pay, the higher your reputation percentage. The reputation percentage earns you a rate discount. So currently I have a 6% reputation, which is earning me a 1.62% discount that is automatically applied to my borrow rate. And the last thing left is crypto loans. For crypto loans, you have to deposit Vigor as collateral. 
and then you can take out any token in the lending pool, either VIG or EOS. More tokens to come soon. So now I have tokens deposited into the lend pool, one EOS, 20 Vigor into savings, 20 EOS as collateral to take out a 20 Vigor loan at 2%. And when I'm ready to withdraw these for savings, withdraw. I'm going to withdraw the max here so I can show closing out the loan. So let me withdraw the 20 Vigor I have in savings. 20 Vigor from savings to my account. Now that 20 Vigor is in my wallet as seen in the wallet balance. And on the Block Explorer we can see that. The 20 Vigor back in my account. So I can come back and repay by clicking repay this 20 Vigor loan. Repay from account for demo to the Vigor lending contract 20 Vigor paying back the borrowed token. And there we go. It refreshes. I no longer have 20 Vigor worth of debt. And now I can withdraw my 20 EOS from collateral if I choose to do so. Withdraw 20.0001 EOS my account from collateral withdraw and we'll see my wallet balance increase from the 11.8995 EOS back up to 31.8996 all at the speed of EOS look on back on the Explorer we'll see the balance here go up now that I've taken that EOS out of collateral if you have any questions please don't hesitate to head over to the Vigor telegram group a custodian or candidate would be happy to assist you. That will be linked below.